Well, hello everyone. Today I'm sharing 12 genius tips to looking more youthful, maybe younger than your age. And everyone watching this video is a totally different age and probably looking for different things. But all of these tips and tricks can be used by everyone to look better and maybe more attractive and youthful. So uh, I also wanna say, I really don't like videos that are similar to this, but are suggesting things like go to bed early, get a good night's sleep. And I know that already. I think you do too, that's boring. These tips aren't boring, so let's get started. Okay, so the number one way to look more youthful, look healthier, just more attractive in general, and this is just my opinion, and after like really looking at people, kind of analyzing them, I just think this makes a night and day difference, but it's having thicker, healthier hair. Now this is going to be no surprise to anybody that's been following me for a while because I've been extremely vocal about my obsession with the Vegamore hair serum and some of their other hair products. So this video is in collaboration with Vegamore, but it's just so darn easy working with this brand because I literally use it every single day and I see visible results. And so many of you are as well. Um, I get messages. I get DMs, I get emails from people saying how much they love their products as well. So I wanna just say I use at this point so many of their products, but I'm going to just narrow it down to some of my like go-to favorites, things that I suggest just giving a, a try if you're interested. So I will have it linked down below. You can always use my code, it's Shay, and you'll save 20% on their entire site. So first though, I wanted to share this hair serum. Well, it's a scalp detoxifying serum. So this is a little bit different than normal, but the theory behind it is so cool and I really see results with this as well. So the point of it is to apply it to your scalp. I usually do it before before I go to bed, maybe leave it on through the night. Other times I will do it about 20 minutes before I take a shower and then I take this scalp massager, also from Vegamore. This thing's amazing. And I really massage it into my scalp. And the point of it is to really detoxify the dead skin cells on your scalp. So if you suffer from dandruff, it knocks it out of the park. It's amazing. Even if you don't suffer from dandruff, it still removes and kind of exfoliates the dead skin cells off of your scalp so that all of the other products that you use will work better. So this is awesome. I also, of course, wanted to share the um, Advanced Hair Serum. So this is the Grow Plus line. They have like two different versions, um, but this is the hair serum that made me fall in love with Vegamore. And it takes a while to start seeing results. I just wanna warn you, um, they do have a three pack of this and you do save some money, but you're gonna see results around month two. So check their website, look at the before and after photos, read the reviews, but it really helps like fill in your hairline. It helps to grow thicker, healthier hair. It also stops shedding. That's another thing. Like I was shedding so much hair, uh, which like it was just bad. It was bad, it was bad, especially in the shower. And this just, completely stopped it, which was fabulous. Um, so this doesn't make your hair greasy or anything. You just apply it to your scalp, rub it in once a day. You can do it in the morning or night, and I keep it right by my nightstand and do it every day. And then that leads me to number two. The next way that you can really appear more youthful is to have longer eyelashes and thicker eyebrows. So this is the Lash Serum. They also have a brow serum. I don't really use the brow serum that much just because my eyebrows are fairly thick, but this serum, another game changer. I have the shortest natural lashes. They're pathetic, honestly. And I started seeing results after three weeks using this. And then at six weeks, I snapped a photo and it's just, and it's even gotten better, to be honest. Like I just love this so much and it doesn't come with weird side effects. There's a lot of other serums out there that they al they also work, but you're gonna get dark rings around your eye. Like I suffered with a few side effects and I stopped using it. That just scared me. I don't wanna be messing with my eyes, but all of the ingredients in here are healthy, vegan, cruelty-free, just really, really good natural ingredients but you also see results. So like I said, if you wanna give anything a try, um, I'll have them linked down below and you can always use my code Shay and save 20%. Okay, so another little trick to having thicker looking hair, like more voluminous hair, <laughs> it's a cool word, is to use this hot tools thing, which was shocking to me. I'm not normally into this kind of thing. Like I don't usually think they work, but I saw my friend on Instagram using it and I was like, oh my good Lord, I need to try that. So I ordered it, it's not even too expensive. I'll have it linked down below. But what's interesting is it's actually like a hair dryer slash styler. So you actually start with your hair completely wet. Now, if you're looking at that B-roll of me demonstrating this, I am wearing some eye patches, which are gonna be coming up and also 
game changing. Um, but yeah, so you start with your hair wet and the way you, you do it, or at least I do it, you kind of do it in sections and it's going to take longer than if you were just to blow dry your hair outright. But the point of this is to dry your hair and style it at the same time. So I find that it's kind of like the same amount of time, if not shorter, and I'm just left with just really just pretty hair. I don't know. It just really, really works. It gets the, the volume up. It also kind of like curls it. It'd be great if you have maybe even shorter hair or some layers to your hair. So anyway, I just definitely recommend this little magic wand. Next, we're doing like an actual like instant little like tricky, tricky, sneaky thing. It's also involving your hair, but it's kind of like if you want an, an instant facelift. The celebrities do this, okay? You think they, they look really good and they a lot of times they do, but a lot of times they're, they're doing weird sneaky things and this is one of them. So if you want to just be more lifted, like you want to like lift up your face, uh, a sneaky way is to literally take a piece of hair on either side, like beside your ears like this and like, lift <laughs> and then you're just going you're, you're gonna like pull it kind of tight and then see like i don't know if you can yeah you can probably see it i'm probably wrinkly but yeah you're gonna tie it with like an elastic make it super tight back there then you're gonna release that and then it's secretly back there you know but you're like lift it yeah I know. <laughs> the next little sneaky trick that's also done by celebrities, by the way, and now that I will, I, I'm going to point this out, you're gonna start noticing it, that people are doing this when you're seeing an interview and now you're gonna know why. So it has to do with your neck though. You can have a beautiful, youthful looking face, but if your neck is having signs of aging and wrinkles and fine lines, it just, brings you way down. So I'm really starting to kind of like pay attention to that area. Like people are so obsessed with getting facials and lasers on their face, but they really should also be paying attention to their neck. So I'm gonna show you two different things. First is just like instant gratification, just something to always have in your back pocket and pull out and it's great. But the other thing is something you can start doing and I think it'll make a difference long-term. So I think everyone should just invest in a black turtleneck. Uh, it can be like a short little mock neck version. Black just to me, it it's just like a good color on everybody. You know, everyone likes black and I feel like it's just the easiest way to do it. So um, I am going to link my favorite one down below and it just conceals your neck and you're gonna see that celebrities literally do this all the time. They might wear jewelry or they will wear a turtleneck and it makes them instantly look younger. But the next thing that I wanted to share that you can start doing and I do, usually every few days, um, it's this Dermalogica Neck Fit Contour Serum. So it's kind of like a skin workout for your neck. So if you notice, it has like this roller ball and you literally like pull up your skin like this and it has this really nice serum and it's hydrating, it helps to reduce fine lines and wrinkles and it's just gonna be really good for your neck long term. But again, it also kind of like works those muscles and the skin and it lifts. So just don't forget about your neck. That's basically what I'm trying to say. Next, I wanna talk about the Peter Thomas Roth eye patches, which you briefly saw me wearing previously. Now, I also wanna say, normally I would not be a fan. To me, this seems a little bit gimmicky. Uh, I'm also not a fan of those facial skincare masks that people wear. Like I've just never really seen a different, to me, it's just like putting on lotion. I don't know. But this also came very highly recommended by a friend. So I ended up getting it and I love it. Like I really like these. Um, I do see a big difference when I use them. So the kind that I have is the Potency Power Brightening Hydrogel Eye Patches. So I use mine about two to three times a week and it, the vitamin C, vitamin C is like very well known for just brightening your skin. So if you have, um, you know, maybe dark circles under your eyes, I'm not saying it's gonna completely get rid of them, but I just, I do see a difference when I peel them off my face. I leave them on for about 10 to 15 minutes and it just hydrates me. It kind of like, it definitely like reduces the fine lines and wrinkles. It just, it makes me look more awake. Like I just, I really like them clearly. So anyway, uh, just another thing to try if you wanna just look a little better. I'm about ready to get into one of my just like favorite suggestions, but I needed to say this first. So this is a dermaplaning tool. Throw out those stupid ones from Amazon that are like $4. They're terrible. Stop buying the drugstore kind. If you're into this kind of thing, which is like shaving your face, 
you need to shave your dang face because oh my goodness, it makes, again, huge difference. It makes your makeup go on better, your skin silky smooth. Uh, you're not gonna grow back thick hair like a beard. Trust me, I've been doing this for years at this point, but this is worth the money. This is like a professional grade. Uh, it's kind of sharp. Uh, you're not gonna cut yourself, but you shave off all of that peach fuzz and then you're gonna move on to this next step. So this is the By Terry Brightening CC Cream, which I have been using this for years, but in my opinion, I've been using it wrong for almost the whole time. So I, I probably have mentioned this before, but it's been a long time. So I wanted to tell you about how I'm now using it. Uh, so to me, back in the day, what I thought you were supposed to do, and you still can do, like people do it like this, but you just put it on your face and it brightens your skin. It looks great. Now, if you have perfect skin, <laughs> good for you. You're, you're good with just this, but I don't. So what I do, and I, I, I'm telling you in the footage, it looks like I have perfect skin. Again, these lights guys, it helps me more than you realize. What I do now is actually put my foundation here on this brush and then I spray a squirt of this and I mix it into my foundation. And then sometimes I go crazy and I also put some on even a different brush and I even put more on top. And my goodness guys, it gives me the most beautiful, glowy, smooth, looking skin. I'm telling you guys, it just brightens your face. It's just magic in a bottle. Also, like, I just really like this. And, and you know, when it comes to aging and even mature skin, you really just want to kind of incorporate those light reflecting particles and it's going to make you look so much younger. So for most of this video, I've been telling you what to do, what to change. This will make a big difference. You're going to see results. But for the rest of the suggestions, it's it's what not to do, okay? So don't do these things. It's gonna make you look worse. So let's start with eyeliner. So if you are still taking your eyeliner and using it from corner to corner, especially on the lower lash line, you are aging yourself. You're, you're, it's just it's just not going to look great. So I love, actually, I don't even think, I'm not even wearing eyeliner today, but if you are somebody that does like it because it, it, it can, open up your eyes and make your eyes appear bigger. So if you do wanna use it, I'm telling you, just try using it on the lower thirds and then buff out the rest of it. And just, just buff, 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 that is the key. Now when it comes to lips, everybody feels like you need just like super thick, voluptuous lips, which those can look fabulous, but you don't necessarily need that. But the one thing I really think you do need uh, is, is a gloss and even me here, like I have more of like a matte lipstick going on. You can see those fine lines and wrinkles. All you need to do is have a good gloss. This is the Fenty Beauty. This is the glossiest gloss I've ever had ever. Um, so just put it on over top and you can immediately see how much younger my lips look with just one swipe. Another thing to stop doing, and maybe it's what you've all been waiting for, uh, is to stop getting the thick acrylic squared off nails, which were all the rage for quite some time. But I think it's officially not good now. Uh, it rounded, shorter, um, even oval shape, that's going to make you look so much younger, fresher, more up to date. Your hands can also age you, whether it be like fine lines and wrinkles or your nails. So if you are still kind of like in, stuck in the rut of just like super squared off nails, you might be looking a little bit older than you really are. So that does it for this video. I'll have everything linked down below, including Vegamore. Definitely check them out. Don't forget my code, you can save some money. But I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you very soon in my next one. Bye.